Hi guys, I'm using right now JSM Prime. Uh, right now you can see. Look. All right, uh, I'm going to show you a gameplay. Just actually a trial right now. A fair enough prophecy. Um. Voila, 3.5 GB. I never expected kind of a size of this game right now. I'm gonna show you. Have a quick look right now. Copyright 2015 published 10. Okay, 2015. Okay, no expected. I actually completed right now a uh, tutorial version right now. I don't see anything right now. Okay. I want to show you some to do right now. Hi, my name is David Cage. Okay. I'm the writer and director of Fire Night. I just thought there's a few things you should know before you get started. I'd like you to meet my friend Bob. You'll be controlling him while you're learning. Let's begin with something simple. Move toward the mark on the floor. The game gun, uh, control is actually now you know sucks right now. About. You're also going to have to be able to observe your environment. To do so, you have direct control of the cameras. Come on, give it a try. You can also look around you and see exactly what you want to see. But you won't be just looking around you in Firelight. You also have to interact with your environment. Go to the door. What the hell is do okay man this control really sucks right now do you see the symbol at the top of the screen it indicates the movement you have to make to execute the action do it slowly to really feel you're controlling your character's hand go ahead Why the hell is not working? Man, see this game really is hard right now. That's cool. Now that you know how to move about, use the cameras and interact with the environment, we can move on to more serious stuff. Fortnite has action sequences where your character's life will be in danger. I'd better explain this to you before you find yourself on your own. When this symbol appears at the top of the screen, it means your character is gonna have to make a physical effort. You'll see, you'll be exhausted too. Exercise great. something a bit more difficult. You're gonna find yourself facing all kinds of dangers in Fortnite. You're gonna need a cool head and good reflexes if you want to survive. Let's see how it works. Wow. Okay, I see you've got 
got the hang of it. Now we can move on to something else. You can also choose what you want to say in dialogues in Fahrenheit. Let's give it a try. Um, what do you think of my friend Bob? <laughs> hey Bob, did you hear that? Right, I see you've got the hang of the dialogues. In Fahrenheit, you'll only have a limited amount of time to make up your mind. So you'd better think fast. Now, let's talk about your mental health. In Fahrenheit, your actions modify the psychological state of your character. Each time it changes, the symbol will appear on screen. Take care of your character, otherwise you may fall into depression, madness, or even commit suicide. Oh, I nearly forgot something important. In Fahrenheit, you'll be able to control all the main characters. Be careful. Your every action will have consequences for the story. A word of advice, think before you act. That's it. I've told you everything I know, or nearly everything. There are still lots of things to discover, but I'll leave you the surprise of finding them for yourself. Now it's up to you to play. And be careful, you're entering a world where anything can happen. Okay, a kind of expecting, kind of a free roam, open world type of game. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll give, I'll show you gameplay of these games right soon. Uh, thank you right now. I will upload it soon right now. Thank you. Thank you.